I'm Pat Cunt, and this is a continuation of my Let's Play for Fallout 3. In particular, we're playing the DLC Liberation of Anchorage. I screwed up with the last, uh, at the end of the last um, Let's Play, in that I did not save properly when I had to leave suddenly. Yes. Okay. Listening post secured. Waiting is killing me. So I quickly played back through, uh, back through the the last uh, mission. Oh come on! I don't understand this recent uh, trend of hitting them without actually doing any damage. At least it sometimes seems to happen. I don't know if it's a quirk with the simulation or if it's meant to be something else. Maybe I'm hit, but it is somewhat frustrating. Okay, so here's another enemy camp. As usual, we want to do as much as we can from a nice long distance because we're a sniper. Before we... Okay, that is a definitely a foe. They're sitting down. Can I take care of them? Well, come on. Do some damage. The dog is a lot less threatening than the, than the dude. There's somebody over there hopping occasionally out of that tent. Let's see if we can take care of them the next time they they show up. I don't see him right now, though. And there are also some foes in that tent. The big difference between two runs is that I was in a big hurry to make it ba uh, back to this point. And I used more grenades, and I went a lot faster. It was actually probably more fun. But... Okay, let's see. I wonder if I could hop on top of this tent. Probably, no. Well, if I can, I didn't manage to. Looks like we're in close combat. Let's see if it can be totally douchey. And give that... Okay, that completely failed to do squat. Is the foe actually inside the tent? Yes. Oh, and I'm out of ammo for the Gauss Cannon. Great. Well... Let's see if I can just pistol this guy to death. Well, sucky weapon, but at least it reloads quickly. So I can do shit damage really quickly. Is there anything over here? Don't see anything. Let's quickly verify that there's... Oh, there's that dude. I'm going to get behind some cover. Because he's probably coming for me. Or not. Apparently he has forgotten about me this quickly. Wonderful. Well, let's switch back to the sniper rifle. Hop around the corner and see if we can take care of him. Yep. Cool. Reload. Oh good. An ammo charger. And some more health. And definitely some more ammo for the Gauss Rifle. Not a lot more ammo, though. A few more grenades. I'm trying to use grenades a little bit more in this.
Okay, now that looks like a sniper nest. And there's another camp. And it looks like the sniper nest is populated. The camp is populated too. Okay, that is one less foe. Let's get ready to duck back into the camp or into the tent if we need to, which we do need to. Fortunately, we're right by this. Ow. It doesn't really matter how badly we kill these guys because more ammo is just around the corner. Okay. So we're back out. And there's definitely a dude in the sniper nest. And there's a, someone over there. Let's see if we can take this guy out. Yep. Uh, looks like that's another sniper nest over there. Let's see, can we take him out from here? I think so. Probably. Yep. Okay. Okay, nothing interesting in here. I'm not even sure why they built... I guess in theory they could head, head in there for other circumstances, stuck behind the walls. Walls are probably pretty good at blocking, uh, blocking fire, or at least visibility, but probably fire too. Nice, snowman. Okay, it seems to me that Sniper Nest is probably actually a good place to snipe. Otherwise, I wouldn't have built it. So, is there anything up here for me? No. Can I do any... Do I, do I see any foes? No, maybe it's not that good for sniping. Is it good for sniping... No, it might be good for sniping Americans. Doesn't have a great view of... of the Chinese. Oh, that is very funny. Okay. This appears to be an unoccupied Chinese camp. Oh, that's nice. Don't see anything in here for me. Don't see anything in here for me. I wonder what this is. Oh. That is probably a loudspeaker that would summon a lot more Chinese folk. Yeah, it is kind of funny how dated these things are and that at this point... The... China hasn't been communist since Deng Xiaoping. Uh-oh. And, uh... And invading us is not particularly likely. Nor would us invading them be particularly likely. It would just be a dumb idea. They took us by surprise. I was the lucky one. Thanks, Thanks for the rest. Look, I've got to get back to HQ. I found some papers before I got caught. Good luck. Interesting. So the Chinese take people hostage in this game. The Americans just kill them. Nice. Nice to know that we're playing the bad guys. So there's an experimental weapon somewhere around here. Spider mines. Which stand up and chase you and then blow up if they get near. They're not particularly fun. I don't see them right now though. Ah, there one is.
Uh, there is another. Let's see if I can knock this thing out. Yes. It's one down. Unfortunately, the other ones are now starting to move. No, I'm not going to shoot it yet. going to wait till it gets a little bit nearer. There aren't really any whites of their eyes to look out for, but... Uh-oh, there's one a lot closer. Great. And apparently I'm shit at aiming at these things. Oh, but shooting one... Looks like it killed the other. There is one more. Somewhere around there. Over there. Okay, if I can kill it before it starts to... No, it, it's already started to move. Ah, good shot. Nice. Okay, there's something up ahead. Not sure what it is. Ah, yeah, that's definitely another one. And it is starting to come at me. Good. I don't know if a sniper rifle is the right weapon to use against these things. A, a machine gun might be more useful. Oh well. There's another one. Great. They seem to have exceptional perception. That despite my ducking and all that, they can definitely see me. Actually, can I just lay mines for them? i going to try laying mines for them. Yeah, mines are a quite effective way at dealing with them. Probably the way that you're supposed to deal with them. Okay, what is over here? Oh, more of these little fuckers. Well, let's just deal with you with mines. I was hoping to get both of those with the same mine, but I guess not. Oh! Okay, well, that took care of them, I guess. Hope there aren't too many more, because I'm getting low on mines. It's a minor problem. Okay, that's pretty terrible. There's another one, but I didn't quite get to it before it started hopping around. Doesn't it doesn't seem to quite know where I am though. And it looks like it's being still, so I should oh. No, maybe not. Okay, there is a dude. Let's see. Would you care to step into my sights? Aw, oh, Fnord. It's a kind of weird thing about the game that scooting left and right is a lot more reliable than changing the angle that you're uh, you're looking at. Scoot a little bit forward. Okay. Somebody else is probably up there. Okay, I can't see them from this angle. Except they are... Okay, now I can see them. They're a little bit closer to me than that other dude was, but the angles are not making it very easy to, to get them. Okay, not good. Okay. 
10 shots left. Not... This is not going to be easy unless I get some more ammo soon. And let's save because it's been a while since we've saved. And given how badly I screwed up last time by not saving... Oh! Oh! That is... Okay, and there is a dude. Oh, that looks like more weapons. That will be useful for me. Yes. More grenades. Oh, missed. Few rockets, which are not particularly useful for me, or er, missiles. Okay, good. I wonder, can I blow that thing up? I don't know. Blow that thing up. The reason I'm willing to waste ammo like this is that there's an ammo supply just over there, and yeah, probably a little bit too far away to, to hit anything. Since the the game seems to enforce a, a maximum range on your weapons, even if you should theoretically be able to hit something. I guess theoretically it might be that beyond a certain range you wouldn't be doing damage, but I think sniper rifles like these probably would have quite an exceptional range. Oh well. I think this is one of the things I need to blow up. Okay. We don't want to be anywhere near this thing when it goes. Oh, we're going to duck in here behind some nice stupid tin that has windows aimed at what we're blowing up. And hope that this is far enough. Oh, didn't notice that. Nice. Okay. Now there is foe up there. Oh, I guess he's probably up in there. Yeah. It's going to be hard getting an angle where I can actually kill him, though. I'll try, but there's all this junk in the way, plus it's a relatively narrow slit to begin with. I guess I'm nervous at looking so completely in this direction. Yeah. Ooh, a lot of foes up in this direction. I probably need to deal with them. Okay, so you... Actually, can I just climb up the stairs carefully? Yep. Great. Well, that's one less. Not sure what that red marker is over there. There are a bunch of red markers elsewhere. Okay, nobody's visible in there. Apparently there are some people down... Oh, oh, there we go. Well, that's at least... That's at least a target. 
Okay, and you are not going to make it easy to hit from up here. Okay. Now we're going to do a bit of a weird trick. Which makes things easier. I think it's... Well, it's strategy, not really a trick per se. Um, we're going to hop on top of this wall. And shoot a giant tank that's on the other side. Uh, uh, oh, well, we're going to try and shoot it. It has nasty energy weapons. And... They are rather brutal when it can get a clear shot at you, or even when it can get a good look at you. But if we wait till it's relaxed, like right now it's cautious, now it's hidden. Oh, caution. Hidden. Good. Caution. Oh. We want to pop up and shoot it and duck right back down immediately before it can get its bearings on us. Where is it? We did some damage. Caution. This really should not work. Ah, get down, get down. Okay, good. Oh, did not mean to get that down. I got down-ish. Didn't I got down more I got more down than I wanted to be. Okay. This is about as down as I want to be at the moment. Let's hop over here and get down. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of a classic video game flaw in that uh, enemies will forget that you exist if you just stay out of sight for a while. With some games. With other games, they'll remember you exist forever, and they'll always know exactly where you are, which is just as ridiculous. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, that might have taken off... Yeah, that took down their radar system. Their aim is gonna suck now. Now I believe it's probably safe to approach them directly. Probably. Plus, they're pretty badly injured. Okay, come on. Get up, get up. We'll shoot them some more. Oh, we'll just shoot their cannon. And that blew them up entirely. Nice. Okay, and let's see if we can... Take out this guy. Yep. Okay. Fewer foes. Looking good. Still don't have a good line of sight from uh, for that guy. And we're running a little bit shy on bullets, but... Let's fix that. I don't think there's any way to get up, uh, up into where he is. Kind of makes one wonder how he gets up into where he is, but... Okay. Okay, and looking good. Okay, I think a bunch of foes are probably going to come into view soon. We blew up the tank. 
Otherwise, you pop around that corner and you're, you have a very nasty surprise <laughs> waiting for you. It's like, I hope you are not using your head. Because it is now not where you are. Okay, I think that's a foe. Yes, it is, but... I mean, another... A completely different way to play this... Would be... To just... Run through... Don't stop for anything at all... And set off all the explosives... I mean, plant all the explosives and then just keep moving. It's a workable strategy. It's not nearly as fun. At least I find sniping fun. And I kind of like having the time to explore all this stuff. Okay. That looks good. That looks good. Some more ammo for the Gauss rifle. More health and more grenades. Okay. Okay, let's keep on moving. Oh, yeah, that's not a problem. And there's a third... ...objective somewhere... Oh, maybe not. Maybe that's where my, my buddies are. Okay. Let's wrap this thing up, soldier. You've hit the target. We're cold. Now the only We're thing tired, left is and fight. we want our goddamn oil back. Uh, all right. Now it's just you and me. Let's go take down the pulse field. Uh, you guys coming, or is it just Sir. really, literally, Sir. the two of us? Maybe it is. Okay, I'm full on ammo. I have plenty of health. Let's go take care of the final bits of this quest. Oh yeah, so there are rockets that come down here. So you kind of have to keep moving and you want to keep an eye to the sky. To see if you can... If anything comes... Whoa! Comes too close to you. You want to dodge at least a little bit. Okay. Let's keep on moving. Well, Sir. what are you doing? Not a good idea. Okay, now that we're on their side... They're going to stop shooting mortar at us. Okay. Okay. There's another Chinese soldier down. And another Chinese uh, soldier down. Thank God. I thought I was a goner. Eight of ten. I wonder if I missed some intelligence elsewhere in the campaign, or perhaps if uh, if there are actually two more ahead. I'll keep my eye out. Gonna be radically optimistic. Think that maybe I can get both of these guys. Yeah, good. Okay, we can head up or down. Doesn't look like down has a lot of interestingness to it. 
more ammo is always nice. Let's see. Yep, that's looking good. There might be something over there. Looks like they realized that we wiped out this entire area. They now feel comfortable bombing it. Mortaring it? I guess that's mortar. I don't actually have a very firm grasp of military termino uh, terminology. that interesting over here or there or anywhere else okay let's press forward looks like there are more trenches trenches in Alaska are an interesting idea I wonder if I wonder if Alaska is has much in the way of actual similarity to here oh nice they just materialize Come on. That's how we do things in a court. Okay, more goodies. Please do not run ahead and oh, you had to. You fucking moron. The guy really should figure out that because I'm I chose stealth weaponry, I would actually like to do things in a stealthy way. Do not engage before I do. I don't I don't want to be forced into uh Oh Guys Stupid idiot. You do not have to be that stupid. And generally speaking, it would not benefit you to be that stupid. Oh, where did you come from? Oh, maybe he dropped down from above. Area clear. Let's move out. Those Inferno units are pretty nasty. Pity we can't grab their weapons. No. Just get out of this mode! Get out of this... God damn you! monkeys I really hate hate it when games are artificially hard just because their interface is hard and I guess it is kind of making up for all the times when the interface makes things easier but man like not being allowed to move Not being able to move while some stupid overhead uh, replay does uh, does things. That's not really... It's not cool. Wait, was there an ammo dispenser? I guess there wasn't an ammo dispenser here. Okay, we're gonna keep, keep on moving then. Oh, spider drone, spider drone, spider drone. Over there, over there. Yes, I'm on this one. I 
see if I can get to, to some higher ground where I can come back and take out that guy while I can actually see him. Oh, rocket launcher. Well, that is no fair. But at least I'm going to be close enough where you're not going to be firing rockets at me. Plus, there is ammo and health restore, so I'm not going to get too worried about getting beat up. Really don't need all these rockets. I don't know why I'm collecting them, but... Let's keep on collecting them. Okay. Okay, we're fully armed. Let's reload and head out. Now, let's see if we can... Oh, there's a force field here. Okay. That's not a great way to do battle, dude. Walking out into the open is pretty dumb. When your enemy is... Okay. Well, there still is a sniper there. I guess I gained a level. Okay, now nothing will keep us out. I improve our energy weapons. Wait, how's our speech doing? We need, we need to keep on working on this. 89. 95. Yeah, our speech is really important. Let's see what else is there? There's tag. No. Tempting. Mm, maybe. Robotics expert is actually pretty tempting. I think for now we're going to keep on doing the intense training. And let's bump our agility up to 9. Okay. Now we have really nice basic stats. Let's head back downstairs and refill our weapon. Because we've really beating the hell out of this thing. Okay. Oh, missed some ammo too. Sloppy of me. Actually, I think there was another path that we didn't take and there might be some some more of those intelligence uh, folders over here. Whoa! Okay, I think it was this way. We haven't been this way before. Uh-oh. Is there anything we want here? Nope. Bye-bye. Except, except one of our dudes got killed too. Bummer. So they have intelligence on us. We're reading their terminals, though. I don't see any... Hmm. No, no, uh, no intelligence uh, folders for me. Sir. All right. Now it's just you and me. Let's go take that Okay, let's head back over. Get fully loaded and Let's 
see. Hey, dude. Okay, I get the feeling this is going to be a complicated area to wander through. Not sure what's exactly here, but... It's probably going to involve some fighting. Are these... Is this a cemetery? Are these... Hmm. No, I guess it might make sense for those to be death markers. Uh-oh. What is that? What is that? Oh. Not a good sign, but I cannot reach it to blow it up before it does whatever it's going to do. I hope you weren't using your head, dude. Because I have to confiscate it. It's contraband. Guys, we're snipers. We don't run in. More gauss stuff. More grenades. Yes. Probably, uh, yep, more general weapons. Or more general ammo, rather. It looks like we have some, some of those mechanized infantry dudes. I guess they're, it's a little bit more literally mechanized infantry than, than usual, since it's these are people who are mechanized. I think normally the term mechanized infantry re refers to troops that are backed by uh, lightweight tanks and stuff like that. Not that I really know what I'm talking about, but... Dude, you do not... Oh! I hope I didn't... Yeah, the 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 armor dudes really need to realize Sir. that when you're facing somebody with a rocket launcher, you want to be near them, not far away from them. You because if oh, you okay? Oh, uh, okay, that was weird. How you doing, dude? All right, now it's just you and me. Uh, Let's go take down. Okay, same thing you just said. Okay. Not sure how this works. Oh, apparently... Anybody who's wearing power armor dies. Okay. See if we can slip up to this and that I don't think I'm wearing power armor, but I'm not sure. Dude, do you really Actually this seems like a case for frag grenades. Let's switch back to a gas rifle. Finish him off. Not a very clean shot, and I don't think gas rifles are precise enough, so... Yeah, need to get a good angle before we do squat. Cool. 
Gauss rifle is down. Uh, that is not really helping me. Okay, we're gonna run it, run over here, and I think this is probably where we can turn off that fuel thing. I'm going to guess that this thing is guarded. Probably by invisible dudes. No. Oh. Okay, and there's another piece of intel. Sweet. Shiny. Montgomery, Field HQ. We are go for the attack. Send in the tin cans. I repeat, we are go for the attack. Well, they move fast. Let's kill that turret. Interesting. What if they, they actually if there's actually anything on this side of the door? No, it's force fielded. And here is the guy I'm reporting to. That'll do, soldier. Stand. You've got an attitude problem since you've completed the training. Good job making it through that simulation. And as agreed, you get your share. Feel free. What the hell do you think you're doing? We should be able to access the restricted areas now. Let's hope it's been worth all this time. Okay, so this is an area where the game gets a little bit wonky. Good work. Because. Local. Because they. <laughs> They apparently break into infighting. You need to have a good Chinese stealth armor. We definitely want to have this. Uh, and you want to get enough weapons that you're not completely helpless because things are about to get kind of hairy. Watch it, local. Uh, I guess actually for this fight, yeah, put this on, grab this. Let's see, there's that sword. It's assault rifle, looking good. A lot of ammo. So basically, just grab everything you can. And when you step outside, you need to be ready for this. If you didn't notice, I'm busy. 
get You're lost. Here to help and help. If not, if you didn't back notice, off. I'm busy. Get lost. Or maybe not. Good to see you again. Normally. Oh, I'm not sure what happened. Uh, she often. Uh, there's supposed to be a fight that breaks out here. Oh, did. Yeah, there is. Actually, easy to die if you're not careful. Sorry, dude, you're getting Adele. Oh, but unfortunately she... She got killed, and she is kind of a, a really good character to keep alive. So I'm going to do something I normally wouldn't do and save Scum here. Do I have to talk to her first, though? I might have to talk to her first. Good to see you again. gonna save here and do I have I, know I might be able to just drop them I'm gonna try and stay a little bit closer to her um where was it and I'll try using the flamer You still alive? Yes, you are. Good. Shoot. She died. I really, really would like to keep her alive. Watch it, Lorco. No, don't. Keep your distance, Mutt. No knowing what you've got breeding on you. Is that it? Is it all over? And you were somewhere else. You saved us. We'll be here for a You may not be... Okay, well. All my... All of the ones who aren't going to be murderous are still alive. Let's see what, what else I can get. These things generally can't be repaired together. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab all of the armor from the dudes that I had to kill. And fix them all up together and then stash them somewhere. It's not in great condition. Actually, I'm not sure if it's worth very much. Doesn't look like it's worth all that much. Wait, was there another dude over here? Maybe not. So there was the dude in here. Hmm. 
There are you. There's you two dudes. Everything well with you? We're still. Good to see you again. Still busy cataloging all the gear you uncovered. Uh, I'm guessing that th there's supposed to be some gear in some areas which I just can't grab because otherwise I grab pretty much all the gear. Okay, nothing over here. It's just rubble. It's not a dead body. Looks like there might be something over here. And is this a workbench? No. Okay. And this is the VR simulator, which is really pretty cool. Though I guess nowadays they would probably use something like an Oculus Rift. And we can fix it. Okay. And that looks good. Actually, so this gives strength bonus. It's not quite good enough to, to let me carry stuff, but it does get my strength up to 220. Hmm. Yeah, not really going to happen to get my weight down by 19. Guess I could drop the minigun on something else. Chinese assault rifle have plenty of those. Minigun is in mediocre condition. Six. Seven. Not quite good enough together. Yeah, I'm just gonna head out. And see... It's possible. Oh. Well, that doesn't give me a map marker. Interesting. Yeah, this is going to be a little bit cumbersome, but... So the whole reason I did all this is that there's an armor that I got that you might not have noticed. Called the... Chinese Stealth Armor. When you... And it makes you mostly invisible whenever you duck. So, like, when you're standing, you're fully visible, but... You duck. It's basically the effect of a stealth boy. Or at least I think it's basically the effect of a stealth boy. Oh, is this another? Okay, I guess there is another dude. And more outcast stuff. Yep, yeah, its value goes way up. Now wear the shady hat. Oh, and this is a very nice armor here. Winterized T-51B power armor. Wait, what cast does it give a strength bonus? No, just radiation and stuff. But due to a quirk in the game, or at least so I've been told by the wiki, um, it is almost indestructible. So we're going to head up and see if maybe Dogmeat and RL3 are waiting for me. If they are, I'll rejoin them and they can carry some of my stuff. I mean, if RL3... Uh, Dogmeat can't carry stuff, but RL3 can. If RL3 is not there, then I'll just drop it. Oh! Yes, Commander! RL3 comes equipped with everything a good soldier Sweet. needs. But your RL3 can assist in carrying equipment if needed. And... Oh, I'm wearing... Well, that's weird. Well, that gets my weight down enough. And this do and dog meat is is waiting there for me. You guys just gonna come with me? Yes. Good. So we're go heading back to my home in. Uh, where is it? Megaton to drop off some of this stuff. Huh? Basically, most, and we're picking up the rest of our stuff that we dropped off to keep weight down. Oh yeah. Madam, may I suggest you seek medical attention? By your command. RL3 comes equipped with Kay. everything a good soldier needs. So basically, for the rest of the game, we're going to be using the stealth suit pretty extensively. So, uh, we're gonna find anything. 
Okay, we don't have a flamer in storage. That can be a useful weapon, so we're gonna... Do we have a Gatling laser in storage? No. Can be useful. So there's only the Gauss, uh, one Gauss rifle. It's useful, we're gonna keep it with us for the rest of the game. This is a cool weapon if you're melee uh, style. I'm not... Uh, always good to keep a laser rifle on you. Minigun already have a fully... Oh, there's a miss launcher and a missile launcher. The miss launcher does a lot more damage. Apparently. I'll get both of these and see if I can fix one with the other. Power fists. Don't need those, but... Pulse mine. Scoped magnum. Oh, I don't have any of my sniper rifles. I don't need the trench knife. Okay. And we're going to drop the outcast stuff. And we'll use this later on in the game, I think. For now, we don't want to carry it with us for the rest of the game. Don't need that at all for later. And it would be good to have some more grenades and stuff like that. Let's carry five pulse gren gren uh, grenades. Pl some plasma st Oh, I meant to be getting this stuff, not dropping it off. Pulse grenade. Yeah, I guess we have enough. Do we have two more pulse mines? Nuka grenades are really fun. Unfortunately, we don't have the recipe for them yet, but maybe we should fix that. Actually, I'll kind of think about that stuff later. Minigun, yeah. Um, could sell it. Don't really need to. Doing decently enough in money. It's I'm, I'm going to be using uh, explosives a little bit more from now on out in the game, so it makes sense to carry more of them with me. Okay, so that looks good. Let's do a quick uh, healing. Oh, get out. Oh, what the hell are you doing, dog? I don't even think... Home, madam. I don't even think that's physically possible. Apparel. Aid. Do we... Yeah, I guess we have enough stim packs. We should probably just carry a few stealth boys just in case. Uh, I can deposit these. That'll be good to sell. Might as well turn these in. Okay, looks good. So we're going to swing by the Arlington Library just to drop off those books, because we don't need them. Okay. Hail. Oh, you, you can't talk while you're sitting down? Really? Welcome back. Very well. Okay. Those are some books for you. Okay. Uh, we do have the stealth armor on. Let's pick a weapon. The Gauss Rifle is a pretty fun weapon for fighting small groups of foes. Next, we're going to swing by and deliver the Nuka-Cola Quantum. To Girder Shade, I believe. Up here. Okay, don't see any foes. There's that horny idiot's house. And here is Sierra, whatever her name is. is hope you met Ronald. He, he's such a sweetie. Oh, I hope you're... Over 20 bo... Okay, not quite at 30 then. Oh well. So, what is there to do next? I would like to go get some more recipes. So there are a few things I would like to be able to do. 
Um, now if you get more schematics for explosives, then more are made every time it seems like you're making some. Like bottle cap mines, I think I got the first level of the schematic for that. Uh, Knickknack is... Oh, so some of these are f come from traveling merchants. Where was that little town? Was it Andale? Th no, Andale was the creepy place. Somewhere around here, maybe? Is it Canterbury Commons? I think it was Canterbury Commons. This is the place where we made a request for there to be a lot more, or a lot better funded merchants. Another glorious day in this man's army. And this looks like a merchant. Do you have schematics for me? Let's find out. Keep it on the level. Wrong dude. I hear you're the one who so I picked up some stealth. Crazy Wolfgang's got just what you need. Assuming you need the random junk that I've got. I don't need that. It's a weapon I've never used, the rocket launcher. Uh Yeah, you don't really have a lot that I need, but maybe I can get rid of that. Um, definitely don't need that. You can have some cigarettes. Looks good. Thanks. Okay. So the person who sells... Oh, okay. So that... The bottle cap schematics aren't from here. The dark gun stuff... Mm. Tenpenny Tower, I guess. Well, shoot, I was just in that area, I think. Really should have taken care of it then. Okay. Really, what I've done here is quite terrible, but... Oh. Looks like this place has seen some better times. Are there any foes still around? Come on, kid. There's killing and maiming going on. We can talk later. It's hard to drink with all that screaming. What are you doing? Sir, searching for targets. Help us. Well, are there any ferals still around here? I'm hoping this won't remain in combat mode forever. 
It might. Or maybe the just exiting and re-entering will cause everyone to chill. <laughs> Look at this mess. We'll have it cleaned up soon. Then it will be a ghoul haven. Care to... Wait, are all the people gone now? Apparently they are. So maybe I have to exit and re-enter again. You are... Hey. Oh. Well, it'll take a little elbow. Hello. Bastards. Could have done it the easy way. It's weird. I... I... Oh, yeah. So I kind of did a pretty terrible thing here. What time is it? It's 3 a.m. So, during daytime, I should be able to talk with Michael hey, Masters. Thanks again. Couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> Look at this mess. We'll have it cleaned up soon. Then it will be Cut it out. Bastards. Well, this stuff is mostly crap. You should have a recipe. Hmm. Michael Masters. At the Boutique Le Chic. Well, except I'm not seeing what I want. You do have 44 and 308, and that's always good. But what, what is it? It's called schematics. Yeah, you should have schematics for... Another status. Okay, we'll step outside and then step back inside. That didn't seem to to well, well, it'll take a little elbow. Okay, you don't have it yet either, so I'm gonna have to wait and maybe yes. come back and you might have what's needed. So let's see, what other schematics are there? There's the Nuka grenade. She was sold by Doc Hoff. get that I need to actually head back up here I think and hopefully I will run into Doc Hoff here. Ah oh, they're again moving off. Another glorious day in this man's army. Are you Doc Hoff or are you somebody else? Nope you're crazy Looking wolf train trade? again. Or Wolfgang. I yeah, let's try waiting a little bit. Okay, so he's gone. Let's try 7 p.m. I don't know if the merchants come at night. Oh, maybe they do. Which merchant are you? 
Looking for that specialist. You again? Okay, don't need you. Okay, let's see. Is there another merchant? Let's try waiting another two hours. Hello. Wolfgang, you are not the merchant I want to see. You're still there. You're still there. Got some junk to unload? I'm buying. Ah, different merchant. You are Yeah. Lucky. A wanderer without a weapon. Please. Enjoy my selection of high quality problem solvers. I don't need this. And I can always use more three oh eight. Or forty four. Another satisfied cut. Uh, you can fix my hat. And my sniper rifle and my stealth armor. Cool. Yes. Okay, You again. Okay, well, Crow. Here to acquire a new. Have a look. See if anything calls out to you. So you're the ammo dude. I'm, or, uh, I mean, armor dude. I don't really need anything from you. Uh, crazy Wolfgang again. Hey there. Trading caps for crap. Step right up. <sighs> Come on, Doc Hoff. Where are you? Oh, that looks like Doc Hoff. Ah, welcome. Well, one. Tell me what you need, and maybe I've got your fix. Sweet. That is exactly what I want. Okay, so I can now make Nuka grenades. And you make that out of cleaner... Oh, quantum, tin can, and turpentine. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, the others are railway... Railway... the. Railway Rifle, which, I, uh, which is a small gun. That is a nice, nice weapon to have. Okay, Underworld or Power World Substation. Don't need the rocket launcher or the... Yeah, so it looks like I'm just going to come across these things, the rest of these things through my quests uh, naturally. So, um, I can... Give me a shout if you need it. I'm gonna save the game just because I don't want to I don't wanna have to repeat that. So what else is there to do? Oh, we could just continue heading, continue exploring. In fact, that might be the smartest thing to do. I think this is probably the regular entrance to the antagonizer's lair. We've already taken care of that. What we're looking to do is actually head northwest. And 
this should take us to the Temple of the Union. Which I think is that kind of beat up looking building over there. The one that kind of looks like it's had its entire top rem uh, removed. Okay. We don't see any foes. Apparently that is not a destination. Or at least it's not a it's not a map marked destination. So we'll keep heading this way. We might check out check that out afterwards. But probably not today because we're over time. We're well, well over time. And I have other things to do today. Oh, nice. Well at least there's birds in the air. It's probably a good sign. So the ground really doesn't look very hospitable. I think if you were to want to start agriculture around here, you would probably give up. I believe I have seen you before. Good to see you. Yeah, lucky Harris. Here, a few of my marvelous toys. What's your business, stranger? <laughs> Hannibal says I'm. Okay. Well, there's somebody coming down to. Let me in. Hannibal is upstairs somewhere. I'm locking the door behind you, so don't try anything. I'm watching you. Don't you be stopping here, lady. You got to talk to Hannibal first. Ah, a visitor. Welcome to the Temple of the Union. I'm not going to... We are all escaped sl until I get... Welcome, sister, to the Temple of the U. Our home is your home, as a symbol of our. Wow, that is really quick. That. We don't have enough, but I have a plan. You make. I tell you, I. I want to move all my people to the memorial site for the Great Abraham. I've heard rumors. I was hoping you would help. One other thing. Talk. Okay, so these are... This appears to be like a self-defense force for uh, an anti-slaver organization. You don't look like much, stranger. She's one of the defense people. This dude looks like You're he's new. an artist. I'm Caleb. Ha Our ancestors honored Link. Okay. So that actually is a pretty nice quest. And of course it's something which I would hope that pretty much anybody would uh would do. Well, come on out. And we're gonna ferme le port. Er, well, actually, that's really bad French. Uh, but I don't actually know how to conjugate uh, fermer uh, correctly. Uh, well, no, actually, uh, we're going to fermer le port. I believe that that's the right way to say that, um, because you would use the infinitive. Uh, I ideally, you would uh, you would be able to f say going to, uh, en français. But I actually am not that. Uh, I'm uh, I'm not up to the task. Okay, so we have a whole bunch of tasks to do in this area. Let's see how close we can get. Not to the Museum of Technology. Not to the Museum of History, not to the Washington Monument, but in oh, and apparently I'm too close to the uh, to this temple to do fast travel. Maybe that's far enough away. Okay, no, it's really weird. Y you have to be a certain distance away in order for fast travel. Before we actually do that, though. We're going to head up 
to there. But before we do that, we're going to end this video and we'll continue next time. Well, I'm Pat Gunn. This has been another episode of my Let's Play for Fallout 3.